वेलकम बैक टू एस के मालिक एंड वी आर बैक अगेन विद अ न्यू क्वेश्चन ऑन फिजिक्स एंड टूडेज क्वेश्चन इज रियली फ्रॉम स्पेशल थियोरी ऑफ रिलेटिविटी एंड दिस क्वेश्चन इज वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग ऑल दो दिस इज माई फर्स्ट वीडियो ऑन अ क्वेश्चन ऑन अ प्रॉब्लम फ्रॉम स्पेशल थियोरी ऑफ रिलेटिविटी सो दैट गोइंग टू बी रियली वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग दिस इज वन ऑफ माई फेवरेट थियोरीज फेवरेट प्रिंसिपल्स इन फिजिक्स and the problem is that the length of a rod is exactly 1 meter when measured at rest what will be the, its length when it moves at a speed of 3 into 10 power 5 meter per second we know that length of any object changes when it moves with any kind of speed that can be said as some small fraction of speed of light and this really seems it doesn't actually change changes after all but so slightly so slightly so slightly that it can be exactly approximated as zero but here it is moving by 3 into 10 power 5 meter per second so we know that it will just change a lot the length will decrease a lot in comparison to with other speeds so here what we see in the problem since we know that length l dash is what is really l times the square root of 1 minus v square by c square meaning that the length of a rod at motion at a speed of v equals the length of the rod at rest times the square root of 1 minus the speed of the rod squared divided by the speed of light squared and if i try to put all the values right here so we know that length of the rod at rest was exactly 1 meter times the root over i would also like to comment on here one thing exactly it has been said 1 meter but we really cannot measure exactly 1 meter there is always a failure always an error in the measurement there is always because the instrument we used to measure it always has an error i cannot tell exactly what is the length of this marker or the length of this board so it has been said exactly maybe it is a future generation that we can exactly measure something okay all right this is 1 minus the speed of rod that is 3 into 10 power 5 meter per second 3 into 10 power 5 meter per second square divided by the speed of light square and we all know it we really all know it there's no simpler law other in physics other than the velocity of light other than about the velocity of light propagation of velocity of light in vacuum that light moves in vacuum with a speed of 3 into 10 power 8 meter per second in vacuum basically in air and in liquids it decreases a lot says albert einstein so here is it 3 into 10 power 8 meter per second squared now if i really want to calculate it so i just find it as 1 meter times the under root of here is it 1 meter times under root of i can just find it as 1 minus 3 into 10 power 5 meter per second squared is what is really 9 into 10 power 10 meter square per second square over 9 into 10 power 16 meter square per second square they cancel they cancel and they also something like cancel you cannot cancel after all entirely but what you really can cancel is this in six times and you will finally get 1 meter and its product with one, root over 1 minus 1 by 10 power 6 which you may finally evaluate and you will really get as 1 meter times the under root of upon 10 power 6 and this is again 10 power 6 minus 1 and this is finally giving us leaving us with 1 meter times the under root of i want to now exactly evaluate it so i am putting 10 power 10 with 6 zeros 1 with 6 zeros actually meaning 10 with 5 zeros instead of using 10 power 6 method so here is it 1 we can calculate how many zeros 6 exactly so 1000000 minus 1 by 1000000 and 2 3 4 5 6 1 2 3 4 5 6 
Now, if re we really try to calculate it, so this is what? 1 tens, 100, 1000, 10,000, lakh, 10 lakh. This is 10 lakh. 10 lakh minus 1 is 90. Nine, sorry, that is 9 lakh 99,999. So this is 1 tens, 100,000, 10,000 lakh divided by 1 0 0 0 0 0 0. Now I know this is really 1 meter. The length of the rod is 1 meter at rest. Remember at rest. But we are going to calculate another length for the rod because we just really know that the length of the rod will change. If I want I can separate. This is the whole rod. Remember this is mathematics that the whole root over x up and y is root over x by root over y. So I want to try this method. I will be calculating it separately. So this is 1 meter into what? It is 1 meter into the root over 999 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, the numerator is really lesser than the denominator if we are having a rational number or a fraction that is a proper fraction. So you may call that whatever final answer in decimals we are going to get, in real numbers we, can, we are going to get. So that will be really what? That will be just in points, zero point something always. So this is going to be uh, something like 999 very little lesser than 1000 so this is 999.99 okay okay we can just know divided by this is surely going to be 1000 because 1000 into 1000 leaves us with 10 lakh so this is actually 0.999999 now after this even after this there is going to be i think 4 and then 999 nine, nine continuously repeating. So at the place of 4 with so many 9s, we can replace it simply with 5 because they are near about equal. You can call them equal. So you can place here at the place of 4 and 9999. Nine, 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 you can call it 5. So finally, after multiplying any digit by 1, we get the same digit. So this is point, 0 0.999 and 999. Nine, nine and in and finally 5 in meters so what will be the final when the rod moves at a speed of 3 into 10 power 5 meter per second that is really so close to speed of light that is 3 into 10 power 8 meter per second then there will be some contraction in the length of the rod and due to that contraction now the length of the rod meaning L dash becomes what it really becomes 0 0.999 and 999 5 meter now actually you will be not able to measure it or you will be not able to look at it really that's true because the even at after having so high amount of speed the change is so small 0 0.999999 so 5 is after so many zeros I was really after so many zeros that you cannot um, after all measure the effect what is the change in length? That is 0 0.000005 meter length has been changed. So that is very much less. So less than inch. So that's the reason. Less than centimeter. Very much less than centimeter. That's the reason. You'll be saying that actually special relativity breaks here. No, the length of the rod is still not changing. But if you really want to see the change, try to accelerate the body to 3 into 10 power 7 meters per second and then you can see the change after all I exactly don't know what will be the length then but if it goes really something like to 99.9 percent .9 of the speed of light the change will be a lot and very much use and finally the problem is solved with the, our correct answer and that was really very interesting problem hope you always liked and enjoyed today's video and today's problem and thanks to all of us for watching this video Jain Jai Bharat